and Ferdinand from 4D Systems. In the earlier video, we showed you how to monitor an ambient temperature using a TMP35 and a Forduino. On this video, we will make things more interesting by making it as an IoT device, sending data to the internet using the ThingSpeak IoT platform that will enable data lagging over a period of time. This is how it works. The TMP35 temperature sensor sends the room ambient temperature and it will communicate with the Atmega 32U via analog input A0. The Atmega 32U converts the unit and requests the Picasso to update the thermometers and the lead digits widgets to the display in both Celsius and Fahrenheit. At the same time, it will request ESP8266 to send the current temperature to ThingSpeak IoT platform for temperature data lagging. For this project, we will need four Duino, TMP35 temperature sensor, a breadboard, some jumper wires, and an account to the thingspeak.com. You can find the complete code for this project at our website. Click on the Forduino project to open a workshop for IDE. Every time you open a new editor on extended graphics, the skeleton code contains the relevant code required for the communication between the Atmel and the GPU running the touch display. And from here, you can type your code. Include the libraries and define variables. Set up the Wi-Fi to your own SSID and password. Add the IP address of the thingspeak.com. Routine to handle serial errors. Define the pin where the sensor pin is connected. On the setup, reset the display. Initialize all serial communications. Initialize display. Mount the micro SD card. Display the widgets, the thermometer, and the LED digits. On the loop, read a signal from the analog pins and calculate. For centigrade, this is the formula. Then, display to the screen at the thermometer 1 and LED digit 1. For the Fahrenheit, convert the centigrade value and display to the screen in the thermometer 2 and LED digit 2. Then use the update template function to send the data to the thingspeak.com. Now, connect your Forduino to the PC. Make sure you are connected to the right COM port. In my case, it is COM6. And simply click on Compile and Load. This will compile and load the code into your Forduino. And you will see that the Forduino will set up and connect to the Wi-Fi. When the connection is established, the display will reset and the thermometers and LED digits will appear. Hope you had fun learning IoT projects connecting temperature sensor with Arduino. For more projects, please check our YouTube channel and subscribe. Thanks for watching.